Bruce Frederick Skinner, commonly known as B.F. Skinner, was an American psychologist, behaviorist, author, inventor, and social philosopher. He was the Edgar Pierce Professor of Psychology at Harvard University from 1958 until his retirement in 1974. B.F. Skinner is best known for operand conditioning, schedules of reinforcement, Skinner box, cumulative recorder, radical behaviorism. Among his many discoveries, inventions, and accomplishments were the creation of the operand conditioning chamber his research on schedules of reinforcement. Biography of B.F. Skinner B.F. Skinner was born and raised in the small town of Susquehanna, Pennsylvania. His father was a lawyer and his mother a homemaker, and he grew up with a brother who was two years his junior. He later described his Pennsylvania childhood as warm and stable. As a boy, he enjoyed building and inventing things, a skill he would later use in his own psychological experiments. His younger brother Edward died at the age of 16 due to a cerebral hemorrhage. During high school, Skinner started to develop an interest in scientific reasoning from his extensive study of the works of Francis Bacon. He went on to receive a B.A. in English Literature in 1926 from Hamilton College. After earning his undergraduate degree he decided to become a writer, a period of his life that he would later refer to as the Dark Year. During this time he wrote only a few short newspaper articles and quickly grew disillusioned with his literary talents, despite receiving some encouragement and mentorship from the famed poet Robert Frost. While working as a clerk at a bookstore, Skinner happened upon the works of Pavlov and Watson, which became a turning point in his life and career. Inspired by these works, Skinner decided to abandon his career as a novelist and entered the psychology graduate program at Harvard University. After receiving his Ph.D. from Harvard in 1931, Skinner continued to work at the university for the next five years thanks to a fellowship. During this period of time, he continued his research on operant behavior and operant conditioning. He married Yvonne Blue in 1936, and the couple went on to have two daughters, Julie and Deborah. Inventions of B.F. Skinner During his time at Harvard, Skinner became interested in studying human behavior in an objective and scientific way. He developed what he referred to as an operant conditioning apparatus, which later became known as a Skinner box. The device was a chamber that contained a bar or key that an animal could press in order to receive food, water, or some other form of reinforcement. Project Pigeon Skinner took a teaching position at the University of Minnesota following his marriage. While teaching at the University of Minnesota and during the height of World War II, Skinner became interested in helping with the war effort. He received funding for a project that involved training pigeons to guide bombs, since no missile guidance systems existed at the time. Schedules of Reinforcement In his research on operant conditioning, Skinner also discovered and described schedules of reinforcement, fixed ratio schedules, variable ratio schedules, fixed interval schedules, variable interval schedules. The Baby Tender In 1943, B.F. Skinner also invented the baby tender at the request of his wife. It is important to note that the baby tender is not the same as the Skinner box, which was used in Skinner's experimental research. He created the enclosed heated crib with a plexiglass window in response to his wife's request for a safer alternative to traditional cribs. Awards and Recognitions in 1966 Edward Lee Thorndick Award, American Psychological Association. In 1968, National Medal of Science from President Lyndon B. Johnson. In 1971, Gold Medal of the American Psychological Foundation. In 1972, Human of the Year Award. In 1990, Citation for Outstanding Lifetime Contribution to Psychology.